why chase grouse? You know, people ask me that. Why chase a bird that is so hard to get and so hard to find that you might spend three, four months out of the year and you get one? Our grandfathers talked about how many birds they'd find in a day. That was going from Maine all the way down to Georgia. The, the grouse were here. And then they slowly started to dwindle away. The ghost bird of Virginia. One day they're there, and the next day they're not. You go to the same cover, find four, and the next day you go out the same cover and they're not there at all. I think the most important part of being a grouse hunter would probably be humility. The only thing you should expect is to get your ass whipped. You'll hit the tops of mountains, you'll hit the bottom of the valleys. You'll hit creeks and you'll hit 12 to 15 degree slope mountains for, for miles and miles on end. Your pants will get ripped to pieces. You'll be picking greenbrier thorns out of your legs and arms for, for probably a week after the fact. You may have to take a dog to the vet to get stitched up after getting cut up in, in locust thorns, but that's part of it. There's a lot of beauty and discomfort. And when you pursue these birds, you're gonna find out a little bit more about yourself and how far you're willing to push yourself in pursuit of something that you really want. Is that the end of the grouse in this cover? They do exist, and I want people to understand that they do exist. And I want them to understand also that their existence is incredibly fragile. If anyone's going to understand how fragile of an environment these birds have to live in, that they have to be a part of it. They have to see it and understand it. And so coming on a bird hunt is going to give people that awareness. As a guide, as a father, grouse hunting has, has probably taught me, most importantly, humility in the sense that I don't always get it right. It's taught me that no matter how much I want to make it happen, there's certain things in nature that you just can't force. But I hope to pass it on to my daughter, and hopefully she understands it better than I do. It's one of the most cherished outdoor pursuits that I have is, is grouse hunting. 